I wanted to take a few minutes today to talk about a pretty commonly asked question with essential oils. The question is, how can one oil do so many different things? I think a lot of times when people hear that a particular essential oil is able to do three, four, even more things, it sounds too good to be true. It seems like one oil should only have one purpose. And the answer to that is actually relatively simple. So I drew up some chemical structures because I love doing that. I'm a nerd. And I thought that, that having that nice visual aid will be able to help with my explanation. So the first structure we're going to talk about is this one. This is a torvastatin. A torvastatin is a medication that is used to treat high cholesterol. And you notice that it's a pretty complicated chemical structure, but it's just one structure. So anything that is labeled as Lipitor or torvastatin just has the one active ingredient in it, and it really only does the one thing. It helps with cholesterol. Now there are other medications, such as like Dayquil, that have multiple effects. So you'll see on the box that it says that it helps with runny nose and pain and cough. And so how does this one medication do all those different things? The answer is there are three active ingredients. So there's acetaminophen, which is something that helps with pain and fever. There's dextromethorphan, which is a cough suppressant, and phenylephrine, which is a decongestant. So even though it comes in one capsule, there's actually three different medications in it. Similarly, essential oils, they might have a single ingredient. So today we're gonna to be talking about lemon oil. The only ingredient in our lemon oil product is lemon oil. But because it comes from a plant, it has tons of different organic molecules in it, which we call constituents when we're talking about essential oils. So I drew up just 10 of the constituents that are found in lemon oil. Let's take a look here. <laughs> There's actually a lot more than even that, but those 10, all of them are slightly different and they all interact with the body in a slightly different way, which is why you're able to have multiple effects from one ingredient. I hope that cleared things up a little bit. If you have any other questions, comment below. Thanks guys. Bye.